Welcome to Popular History, where we delve into the past to uncover the stories that shaped our world. Today, we turn back the pages to a pivotal era in Roman history, the reigns of Tiberius and Caligula. Imagine the grandeur of Rome in the first century AD, a world of marble and magnificence, of power plays, and the pulsing heartbeat of an empire at its peak. Tiberius, stepson of the great Caesar Augustus, ascended to power amidst a cluster of conspiracy and reluctance in 14 AD. He was a seasoned general, a man more comfortable on the battlefield than in the treacherous waters of Roman politics. As emperor, Tiberius was a competent ruler, but he grew increasingly unpopular. Sometimes seen as a dark and reclusive figure, he retreated to Capri, leaving a dangerous power vacuum in Rome. In his absence, the ruthless Praetorian guard prefect Sejanus maneuvered for power, ultimately falling victim to his own ambitions as Tiberius purged his supporters, causing widespread fear and paranoia. Upon Tiberius's death in 37 AD, Gaius Julius Caesar Augustus Germanicus, known to history as Caligula, took the throne. Caligula's first months were like a golden age. The young emperor was beloved by the people but the golden boy soon descended into a spiral of depravity, madness, or possibly shrewd political terror, depending on whose account you believe. He spent extravagantly, challenged social norms, and declared himself a living god. He's even said to have made his horse a consul, if the tales are to be believed. Caligula's wild reign instigated a plot amongst his own guards, leading to his brutal assassination in 41 AD. His death marked another bloody chapter in Roman history, and set the stage for his uncle Claudius to take the mantle of power, leading Rome with a far more tempered hand. In the end, the legacies of Tiberius and Caligula are intertwined, a story of power's potential to corrupt and the empire's capacity to endure through the most turbulent of storms. The empire would surge forward, but the stories of Tiberius and Caligula serve as stark reminders of the fragility of power and the fleeting nature of glory in ancient Rome. Thank you for taking this journey through history with us here on Popular History. If you enjoyed unraveling the threads of Rome's past, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more historical adventures. Share your thoughts in the comments below and join us next time as we explore the annals of history to bring you more tales from the past. Farewell, fellow history enthusiasts.